This is Gene Key, KDD, Texas News. From Grapevine, the Associated Press reports six members of a Texas family apparently opened Christmas presents just before a relative dressed as Santa Claus showed up, opened fire, and killed him before killing himself. Police say they now identified all of the dead, but no identities will be released until next of kin are notified. According to investigators, it appears that two families are involved in the apparent murder-suicide. Four women and three men, age 18 to 60, were found in an adjoining kitchen and living room area when police entered the apartment around midday. Two handguns were found near the bodies in the apartment that was decorated for the holiday with a tree. Houston authorities say a police sergeant feared for his life when he shot and killed a driver of a speeding car who became combative after the wreck. The Associated Press reports police spokesman Keith Smith said Monday the sergeant saw the speeding car strike another vehicle and then crashed into a ditch. The driver got out and began walking away. When the officer ordered him to stop, the man initially refused, then appeared to comply when the sergeant pulled his gun. Smith says a struggle broke out as the officer was escorting the unarmed man to the patrol car. The man's name was not immediately released. The Houston Chronicle reported the sergeant was placed on administrative leave, a standard procedure after an officer involved shooting. Authorities are trying to identify skeletal remains found partially buried in a wooded area of San Antonio. The Associated Press reports homicide sergeant Larry Ripley says no identification was found and authorities aren't immediately certain if the remains are of a man or a woman. Ripley told the San Antonio Express News only that the remains appeared to be too large to belong to a child. The bones were discovered Sunday afternoon by a man and his son walking through the woods on San Antonio's southwest side. If you would like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD, Texas News.